All right, human body. Let's see if we can get a few more items going for the human body. For uh, okay, let's see here. Quadrants. Let's talk quickly about quadrants. We already did the directional terms, um, and even the directional terms we talked about the hypochondriacs and uh, epigastric and so on and so forth. But we didn't talk about um, quadrants. All right, so let's talk a little bit about quadrants and what is located in each of the quadrants. So there are four quadrants um, of the abdomen. All right. Simply, you can refer to it as the uh, right upper quadrant, um, left upper quadrant. Right. We have right lower quadrant and left lower quadrant. All right. And here, let's see if I can get you a quick image of this. All right. So essentially, this is the quadrants, right? Right upper quadrant, left upper quadrant, left lower quadrant and right lower quadrant. All right, now the importance of this is really it helps in, in terms of uh, diagnosis. Right? If somebody came in for instance and said that I uh, let's go back to this. If I had a pain right, and you were able to uh, narrow down the pain to let's say the right upper quadrant well then you will be able to um, diagnose a few things and see what the possibilities may be in terms of what disease and so on and so forth. Right? So what can we find in the right upper quadrant? Um, Okay, let's see where's that image. That's the image. What can we see in the right upper quadrant? Right over here. Right over here. Right over there. Okay. In the right upper quadrant, let's get back to our okay. So in the right upper quadrant we have the right we have the right lobe of the liver. Hey, what's that? Oh, who's that? OB? Right lobe of the liver. OB. Sounds like um one of the cartoon characters there. All right. Um, we also have the gallbladder. Yeah. We have parts of the pancreas. Pancreas. Come on, pancreas. Um, we have parts of the small and large intestine. 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 Okay. Jeez, spelling is going going into the crappers. In, in what, what is that? Intestine. What is that? Um, intestine. Right, left intestine. All right. So that's where you located. So basically, you will be to it diagnose things with the right upper um, parts of the small intestine, parts of the large intestine, pancreatitis, pancreas, gallbladder, gallstones, possibly uh, right lobe of the liver, um, so on and so forth. All right, hepatitis or something. Well, I don't like the hepatitis, but anyway, uh, you you get the idea. All right, so those are the things that we look at. So quickly, let's go over what would you find in the left upper quadrant. All right, uh, in the left upper quadrant, left upper quadrant. In the left upper quadrant, we're going to find things like uh, again, uh, here you still find a lobe of liver, because liver is huge. Uh, you certainly will find parts of the stomach here. Right. And there goes my cell phone again. Um, <clears throat> spleen, parts of pancreas once again, because pancreas is huge. Um, and once again, you still find parts of the uh, small and large intestine. All right. So now let's take a look back at this picture here. At a right lower quadrant, what would you find in right lower quadrant? So we're gonna leave this up here instead of me having to type it again. Um, not to be lazy, but just to make things go a little faster. So let's remove this and say right lower quadrant. In a right lower quadrant, we will still have parts of the small and large intestine. But here we can add one more thing here. We can also have the appendix. We have the appendix. Uh, we will have the right ovary. Yes, I heard you ring and I, I understand that you were still there. Okay, and apparently you didn't get the message for some, so you call in again. Okay, let's just ignore that one for now. We have the right ovary. Uh, we have the right... That 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 is annoying. We have the right fallopian tube if you are a female. And we have the right 
ureter, which we'll talk about ureters later on. Okay. Right, well, that was a fun tone that when it lasted. It's annoying. All right. So these are the things that you're gonna find um, in the right lower quadrant. All right. So now let's return back here to our our, our image here. Okay. Uh, now let's go to the left lower quadrant and we're mostly going to leave most of these things here uh, because some of them are also going to apply to us as well alright uh, so instead of the right ureter here you find the left ureter alright and instead of the right fallopian tube you can just replace that with the left fallopian tube alright um, again right ovary you can re replace that with the left ovary alright yeah have something about these things not matching them, so I have to go back and match them up. Um, no longer would you find the appendix here, okay? Um, and again, you will still find parts of the small and large intestine, and certainly you will not find the pancreas unless something is seriously wrong, all right? So that is your quadrant. Right? Have any questions? As always, just look down. Um, you can watch the video again. You can rewind the video and. When you rewind the video, you get a chance to hear the, the ringtones um, one more time. Other than that, I will see you in another one. All right.